Are you getting the MEM03 error on your car when you try to update to Sync 3.0 with, with a flash drive? Um, I was getting that and I found a fix for it. There was an article online where someone was messing with the auto in install file um, saying, oh yeah, do this and then this. It, it, it didn't work for me, but the concept was right. Uh, so I messed with his concept a just, just a little bit and made it work for me. Um, so I will show you how I did that. Um, so yeah. Uh, let's see here. So you're given these three files. Auto install, whatever that is, and then all the files in Seek My Ride. Look at this. This file is a gig. This file is 500 megs. This file is 700 megs. And these are just tiny files. So what I did first, uh, let's see here. I deleted all of this, saved that, plugged that into my car, and it ran the update. I, I didn't have to do anything. The car was just on, and I ran the update. It said it's, it, it succeeded. The car was still at version 2.0, but that's fine. So then I, <clears throat> I came back to my computer and I deleted this and it still gave the MEM03 error. And if you wanna know why, it's this stupid little file right here, uh, AL. And if we look, AL right here is 400 megabytes. So apparently when it's trying to install this and this, it runs out of memory or, or something. So, oops, whoopsie. I did this. I took out this. Oop. I saved it. Oop, sorry. I saved it. Uh, then installed it to my car and it succeeded uh, still at version 2.2 so then I came back to, to my computer deleted all of this and I renamed this saved it and reinstalled it once, I, once all these files got installed, once everything, once all of these have finally gotten into the car, it finally rebooted and went to version 3.0. That's how to get around it. So I hope that helped you. I hope it works for you. Um, I also got some errors like mem uh, let's see, error LS0456 and 7. I don't know what that was, but it's just how you set up your, your, your install. Uh, do not use a Mac. Something happens when you try to, it, to extract the uh, zip file, um, and it messes up all the folders. It, it Just don't use a Mac. I tried it. Uh, it looks way different than on Windows. I think it's just how Macs ex extract uh, that zip file. Um, but yeah, don't don't use a Mac. Uh, use Windows. Yeah, I hope that worked. Um, that should get you up to Sync 3.0. Uh, I had a problem. It took two months for Ford to fix it and two of the tickets or uh, two two tickets. Um, I would try to download it and, and it would say error. Um, system error. When I went to, to their website to download the update file, the sync, and I'm not sure why, uh, it was only to my VIN, to my car. Uh, so what I, what I had to do is I had to go to a car selling site, get the VIN of that car, of my car, non-nav uh, na navigation, and uh, and add it to my my Ford account. 
and I downloaded it, finally worked, um, and I was able to install it to my car. If you want to get, if you want to be be safe, and you're having that same issue, um, go to Ford. Go to uh, the web hel helper where, where where you can do a live chat. Talk to that per person and say, "Look, I've tried it. This is an ongoing it it an issue. Uh, can you open up a help to a, a ticket?" And they'll open up a ticket, and within a day or two, you'll get contacted by email. Um, and within a week, a week or two, they'll say, "Oh yeah, try now." And it may work, and it may not. Uh, it took me two tickets, and then after so the first one, they said, "Okay, it's done. Try it now." Didn't work. Second one, "Okay, it's done. Try it now." Didn't work. I emailed them through that ticket and said it still doesn't work and then silently it just worked they fixed it and it just worked uh, th so it I wasn't able to hook my car to Wi-Fi and download it it said you have the latest up update I'm on version 1.0 at that time version 2.0 uh, I updated with different means um, still said no update file found and once they fixed it once they did their end it finally worked uh, it my car would try to download it and update every every time it would, it would show downloading but never work <clears throat> the file size is two gigs I hooked it up to a Wi-Fi hotspot it took it it was downloading seven gigs of, of, of files and it just kept going 13 gigs 15 gigs. it never whatever reason it never downloaded the, the file it was just taking in data like a black hole so yeah the only way was by downloading it and installing it and yeah that was it that was the only way to fix it I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that helps you um, it, if not you are screwed <laughs> sorry all right bye